Yes, good day. Welcome to Marty's Beer Show, where today we are doing a blind test on Great Northern beers. See if I can tell the difference between the full strength Great Northern and its non alcoholic cousin. Uh, I got requested this by a viewer Mitch on my uh, YouTube channel, this YouTube channel, actually, to see uh, if I could do that. So I thought I will. So to keep this honest, what I'm going to do, I'm going to get uh, the Great Northern Original, which is a full strength beer. I've got the. Um, Super Chris, which is a mid-strength beer. I've got the Zero Full Taste, which is available at Supermarkets Beer. And I'm going to make up a Shandy with some uh, Woolworths brand soda water and a full-strength beer. And the Shandy to see if it tastes the same as this. I'm going to get my lovely assistant to pour these into glasses for me, uh, number them, and hide the results. And I'm going to try and tell the difference. So um, without further ado, I'll... Uh... And there we go, with the power of post-its texture and a bit of funky editing we have got some beers that I don't know what they are so it's some great northern so I'm gonna put my fisherman's hat on and let's have a fucking dig into these ones eh? number one don't know what it is it's a great northern of sorts but that tastes pretty good the results are under here I don't know what it is one good tastes like beer Tastes a bit weaker. That's kind of the strongest one. That's a bit weaker. That's really weak. That could be the shandy, but I uh, will know. That's even shandier. Fuck me, I reckon. I'm gonna go one. Is original. Original, one, two. Oh, mate. Two is mid, three is shandy, four is the zero. Very hard. They all taste very the same. They're pretty much the same beer. So, I see. Is the fucking is the zero that much different to the real deal? Here we go. Number one was original. I was right. Pretty good beer. People drink it. Go to the pub. A lot of pubs now. You can have the the original or super uh, the other one. Two different ones. Can't get the zero on the pub. Anyways. Number one was the original. It definitely tastes a bit of strength. Number two was the shandy. Now shandy's not always out of soda water. It's out of lemonade sometimes, but I had soda in the fridge, so. I did not pick that. Number three. Well, I thought number three was a shandy. Number three was the mid-strength. And number four. I did pick as a zero. A bit different to froth, right? Definitely tastes a bit weaker. Definitely tastes a bit weak. Um, but it still tastes like beer. But there you go. Is zero beer good as good? It's, oh, it's all right, but each their own if you've got a thing. Go check it out. Um, because you can buy it from the supermarket. I think even some uh, some servos are starting to sell a fucking uh, non-alcoholic beer. So it's I need that fucking taste. It doesn't taste that bad. If you just want a fucking refreshing drink, I don't know. It's a, if it's um, it's, you know, got any good stuff going for it in regards to a anything. But there you go. It does taste a bit different. Thanks for watching my show. Go check my other ones where I drink beers as well um it's common it's a reoccurring theme in uh marty's beer show and uh like subscribe and all that shit and, and if, you, if you have any uh any suggestions for a show i should do let me know and i will do it i'll, I'll do it marty's beer show is good do it watch it drink beer